Hi all, welcome to my channel, welcome to my world, this is The World Away, and it's Saturday, it's time for another Welcome to the Cave. Now, great channel today from Chris over at TK421 Collectibles. Um, I've actually, he's actually got a YouTube channel and I'm gonna put a link in the video description, but if you wait to the end of the video, I've also put a link on the end screen card as well. So you can just click on the little icon there and that takes you to his channel. Now, uh, Chris has got absolutely loads of Star Wars memorabilia. I can't even say the word memorabilia, uh, especially uh, some of the Hot Toys uh, range. And you're gonna love some of the things in his collection. But Chris is here to introduce himself so without further ado over to you Chris. Hi Wayne, hi Wayne's viewers um, I've been watching World of Wayne for many years now um, I, like, I like the Welcome to the Cave segment he does so I was hoping you wouldn't mind putting my cave on um, if you do me th that honour. It's mostly Star Wars hot toys as you can probably see from the background but if you want to take a closer look let's have a look We'll start on this side, so we've got um, Stormtrooper, Princess Leia, Luke Skywalker, Obi-Wan Kenobi, Sandtrooper, and the Jawa and Gonk droid. And guarding them at the minute is Terminator, he's just having a bit of a sit down. He's almost finished, well he is finished actually, it's just the base now. Uh, we go A New Hope, Darth Vader, Tarkin, another trooper, um, Chewbacca and Han. Darth Vader, Empire Strikes Back version. Darth Maul, Phantom Menace one with the speeder. Um, Obi-Wan Kenobi, Commander Cody. And Count Dooku, Anakin Skywalker, it's a light side version. Qui-Gon Jinn. And the little guy at the bottom, obviously Yoda. Return the Jedi section, Emperor's Guard, and there's Palpatine. And below these, Boba Fett and the Sarlacc Pit. And then we have Leia and Wicket, two pack. And below them, Luke Skywalker. These are all six scale figures from Hot Toys, if you're not sure what they are. Um, if you have a look at my channel, TK421 Collectibles, uh, I'm just starting it out, it's only been going a couple of months, but. I go into a bit more detail on each figure, or at least I'm trying to. So here we've got Jorah Steel Mando and Heavy Infantry Mando, and then Beskar Mando with Grogu, IG-11, Scout Trooper, Remnant Trooper, Incinerator Trooper. So we're getting quite a good collection going here. Then the first of the Clone Wars ones, 501st Battalion Trooper. Uh, a couple from the Solo movie, Patrol and Mud Trooper. And Darth Maul from the Solo movie. He's a pretty cool figure. Like metal legs as well, and and then Han Solo. Sorry about the glare on the glass. And then we've got a bit of a Rogue One collection, apart from the uh, Death Star Gunner. We've got Shaw Trooper. It's quite difficult to find now, really, the Shaw Trooper and the Death Star Gunner. And then K2SO, and then we've got uh, Jin Erso Imperial Disguise version, Chirrut Imway, and then normal Jin Erso version, and the Death Trooper, and then finally uh, Director Krennic. Obviously, there's loads more coming, so um, if you want to check the channel out, please feel free to. It's a fledgling YouTube channel, I'm quite new to it obviously. Um, well, Terminator base there already. Just two more issues to go on that one. And if you flick round over to the side of the room, we've got the um, Eagle Moss, pretty much the complete Legend of Batman series. I think they're going up to issue 100. I think we're about 83, 84 now. Um, the Xbox Series X and World of Wayne playing. One of the first videos I was watching of Wayne's was the Millennium Falcon build so I had to get it in the end just bought the full kit painted it myself not too great I'm not too impressed with the paint job on that but it was my first effort um, and I'm building R2D2 right now 
looking at Wayne's videos because I'd be lost without them videos, knowing which screw was which, which screw to use for which bit, and uh, obviously the X-Wing almost nearing completion. And some of the videos that I first, very first watched to Wayne's was when he was collecting these Star Wars helmets from Diagostini. Um, so I've got these as well at the same time. Uh, there was issues 1 to 40, I think. There's, uh, that's an old uh, Star Destroyer I got in Disneyland, I think, back in the 90s. Um, and the rest of the there's episode uh, issues, something to 60. <laughs> 41 to 60. Maths isn't my strong point. And then um, 61 to 80, and that's the full set of the D'Agostini Star Wars helmet collection. Beer poster, obviously Star Wars related. Good beer that, I like that beer, Stormtrooper beer. And then a bit of an art wall here, some Batman tin comic covers, and a bit of Star Wars again. And then obviously the Star Wars A New Hope poster. And then down here I've got some Batman Steelbook collection and um, Palisades Alien that my wife got me many, 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 many years ago. And that is it. Hope you enjoyed this quick look around the uh, the man cave. Uh, thanks a lot, Wayne, for featuring it. Thanks for all your videos over the years. Pretty much watched every one of them, I think. And congrats on your 40k subs. Um, see you later. Absolutely love it. Some of those figures there, you know, if I had the room, I would display them. But if you want to display your man cave, what I've done, I've put a link up here for the WeTransfer site. All you've got to do is upload your video to wetransfer.com and then just send it to my email address, which is down the bottom there, wayne at worldofwayne.co.uk, and you can get featured on the channel uh, in the Welcome to the Cave segment. But I really do hope you like that video. If you did, please remember to give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed already, please remember to subscribe. Remember, click on that little button for Chris as well and go and check out the TK421 collectible site. Take care.